and I will start us while you're playing. Hey, everybody. Welcome hey! Welcome back to Game Does Play Games. <laughs> you just saw the end of an epic battle. Uh, I was doing Chris so good. just getting eaten by the old one. You know, the sucky thing was is that we had... One. <laughs> we We synced the camera footage to the audio and the game footage all, like... During like while avoiding that that I boss in a moment that like the fear wasn't there anymore then <laughs> that was when I died that, yeah. yeah did so good too for what it was uh, one thing we forgot to mention about this boss in the woo in the last episode is that when he starts getting to that point where he like spits the uh, that massive cloud at us where did he go in the wall I guess and then you died yeah I got a little boingy there. <laughs> Is that, can it's you best say way. that on YouTube? But <laughs> <laughs> are we gonna get? Are we gonna get red flagged for that? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, uh, he uh, he recovers his health after like he spits out that little gas cloud, and when the cloud comes back to him, he uh, he recovers health. I think he also loses a little bit of health when it happens. So I'm not sure if it's like if he truly recovers health, or if it's just like. Closer. Closer. Mechanic to kill him. If we get too close, though, he's gonna suck me in. Not when he's doing that. Oh, sucking you in. Get behind him. Yeah, I guess I didn't realize that it was angled like that. I thought it was just you get sucked in every. Wow. Apparently, his ooze, ooze trail. No, no, no. I got. I got. I got I... Let the guy Please. who's never played before. Please. You did it once. It was. Well, I guess you did also fail at the tranquil. That yeah. was when we were using the steam controller, yeah, and we uh, had a chance to use a mouse on it. Yeah, we had to learn some things about that steam controller. I uh, learned a lot of things about that steam controller. So much that I was thinking about doing a whole episode on the steam controller. I still think that would be kind of fun. It would be like not our normal stuff, but it would be uh, be unique. It'd Sounds be interesting. like something that needs to go in the uh, voting. Ooh, yeah. I mean, it's only Ooh. really good for a, a one-off episode for sure, but. Oh, God. His face. He's nice. eating his own face. Kind of is, yeah. That's the name way. of the episode. Eating his own face. I really like it when we name episodes during the episode. It makes my <laughs> life a lot easier. The number of times I've s sat in front of my computer, like, post-editing, where I'm like, all right, now I got to name this. What the hell do I name it? And, like, I'll sit there for, like, a good 30 minutes just racking my brain for anything creative. And, uh... It never comes. So if you ever see any lame named episodes, that's what was going on. <laughs> oh, f wait. Can you shoot those? I can, like, to it just move pushes them. them out of the way. Okay. There is a boss later on where I believe that actually becomes necessary. Like, you shoot the little components that are floating that in the environment that uh, it prevents it from, like, healing or something? Or maybe I am just thinking of this boss, but... You can shoot them back into him. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh, that's how he's healing. He's eating the things back. Like, oh, he's absorbing so them maybe... Back. Oh, I remember! I remember! It is this boss, and you don't use the harpoons for that. You use this handy-dandy saw. I don't know why I forgot that. Well? I'm really hoping that this guy's gonna give me a speed upgrade. That's, like, the one thing I really want right now. Either that, or he's gonna give me the, uh... Oh. Wouldn't he give you a hard thing, like a boost, or, like, a, like an actual new mechanic? Um, Isn't I don't, that what bosses are? No, they don't all give you new new mechanics, um, because otherwise then they'd have a maximum of what like eight bosses because there are only eight mechanics. Um, but they definitely have more than eight bosses. Also, oh. I'm already like saws. <laughs> well, it also hurt me. <sighs> Love this game. You know, when we had a fan. <laughs> We had a fan that uh, recently subscribed to us and was watching our, our first session of this the playthrough of this. And uh, he was like, hey, I love the series. And I was like, ah, cool. Uh, let's see if, like, you know, what videos he's done. And uh, or he was like, ah, I, I've been doing a, um, a speed run of this a lot, like, over and over again. And I was like, oh, sweet, maybe he has a video on it. And uh, lo and behold, he did. And he beat this game in 20 minutes. And, uh, and he was, like, really not impressed with his own time. But I'm just like, man, like, if I could do that, I'd feel pretty good about myself. So kudos to you, man. No joke. I mean, that puts you to shame. You can't even beat the boss in 20 minutes. Well, okay, to be fair... <laughs> There's no... no. To be fair, I'm not playing this 
Uh, whoa! With the optimal, like, playthrough. He's, he's healing so much, it's like you did nothing. I know. I know. I, I'm sure there's an optimal path, though, that the designers had in mind for this game. Like, it, it doesn't hold your hand, which is actually something I think is really, really awesome about this game. Um, ooh, I really need to be faster for this. Nah, you got this. I mean, worst case scenario, Take we come hits. back and fight this guy later on, oh, too. What the, stop, stop that, because he's right? actually not hurting himself when he's spitting out like that. I don't understand oh. either how, like... How does this heal him? Because it actually does require his sort of body to be able to spit those out to begin with. It's like, how does getting them back heal you? Shit. I feel like he's spitting out less now. Maybe I'm crazy. That's possible. Or it's just a randomly generated number. Oh, it looks like he did. Wait, okay. Cut one of them. Come on. Okay, yeah, no, no I'm damage. Just crazy. Did you think I it saw it go down? And then it went back up. That would actually be kind of cool, because like there's it, like, only tricks you into thinking Whoa. that you know what the boss is. Man, he went crazy for a second. Yeah, he did. It's not gonna be like the tranquil. We're gonna feed okay, him. Okay, so right now while this is happening, that's when you cut them. Oh shit! Oh shit! So when you're being chased by a green cloud, that's when you cut a bitch. Yep. Yep. Cutting a bitch. Cutting a bitch. Ooh. And he's done following you now. Okay. That's so bad. Not too shabby. Not too shabby in... My god, man. Whoop. Toro, Toro. Oh. <laughs> I will say the saw sometimes I have a hard time with because uh -oh. you can still... Uh, you can take damage from a lot of... Angles. Oh god, Why just the saw is just green clouds. Cut it, cut it, cut it. Oh no. Oh, I okay. missed him, actually. Oh god, oh god, oh god. Man. Yeah, he's not an easy one. I don't think you're gonna beat this, at least this episode. Uh, well, if we don't beat him this episode, we'll come back to him later because I don't want to spend too much time uh, beating a dead horse or a dead fish. <laughs> man, <laughs> uh, man, and I was so confident when uh, we started this. Dad jokes. Oh, yeah, I brought no. the hashtag into no. this video. Oh, oh, you suck. Man. All right, one more. Really? Got this. Got this. Uh, I got to remember where we get the uh, the upper harpoon because that makes this game tremendously easier, which. It's almost a little sad because I feel like the harpoon being only um, like half circle radius was kind of fun, but as soon as you get the other harpoon, it's like now it's just a normal gun. So I'm, I'm just watching patterns here, wondering you know, like if you're just bad. bad or it's a little bit of both. I mean, there's there is a lot of randomness to it, but like. I'm not doing a good job at dodging. Whoop! All right. Well, that was that one. <laughs> Embarrassing. Yeah. Well. You got beat in Pipe Central by the forgotten so, one. So here's here's my plan. We're gonna teleport back to an earlier area. Yeah. And fight some of the bosses in that area because I think we've strayed too far from the pack, so to say, and uh, get some better upgrades, and then come back and fight the parasite and this guy. I'm sure. I mean, you can that's, find the upgrades. well, that's the good thing about this game is that if you do encounter something that's like too hard, right? You can you can usually turn back and be like, "All right, I'll fight this fight another day." In fact, I think that always oh. happens. I don't think there's ever a scenario. Oh, this is another one of those dead ends where it's like I just like can circumvent this by going another path. This is this kind of takes back takes us back to um, something I, I was bringing up I think by like episode two or three of our, of the series, where I was saying that oftentimes the level design seemed kind of like arbitrary, um, in that like there are, are just challenges that don't really do anything, and and it's obstacles like that that made me feel that way. That's fair. I'm wondering if there's, if it's because they were trying to give that sense of exploration, so they wanted you to have multiple paths. Maybe, but, but like, if it's so easy to just like go around the long way, 
I, I feel like it doesn't work from a, a level design perspective. I feel like it still kind of feels arbitrary, ultimately. Mm-hmm. Um, I think there needs to be more, like, justification of having, like, those those other paths, other than it just being, like, a little bit shorter. You know, there aren't too many of those places in the game that use that, like, the, the water current that mm-hmm. you have to... Oh, look at that little guy. Dude, it's like a bronchiosaurus? Except underwater and uh, with a, a leaf on his head? Source, I want to say. Is yeah, I think no, bronchiosaurus no, isn't wrong. actually a real thing. Completely wrong. No, Brachiosaurus is the one on land, and that was the one that was considered fake? Yes. That was, I I think that was found out that it was fake because they just arranged the bones incorrectly, and Mm -hmm. it actually was like... The Brontosaurus. There's totally a symbol right here. What the hell does it mean? It's the, uh, the the pyramid with the eye. (laughs) The, um, 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 wow, I can't think of it now. I, I, I actually don't know what it's called, so, you know, whatever. Man, you don't live on the oh, internet very much. Oh, just bounce. Well, can't go there. <sighs> I guess this is probably going to lead into our question of the day then, which we should probably do now since it's nearing that time. Yeah, okay. Um, those alternate uh, routes that you can take... Um, that lead to the same place. That lead to the same place. Do you think that that's, like, well utilized? Do you think that there was a good purpose for that in this game? Uh, additional yeah. questions about that? Yeah, or even maybe, like... Hmm. I mean, you, you kind of said it, said the same thing that I'm trying to think of with being, like, is it being utilized? But, like, should they be used the way that they are? I think is ultimately my question. Um should there be more like justification for them like they all lead to a, an upgrade or, yeah. or like a whole new area do do those alternate paths actually give um do they give a, sen- a sense of, of choice and meaning behind them ah ooh, yes. that's a good one actually because that's a really sensitive game well not sensitive but it's a hard to it's a hard well, thing to achieve it's not entirely incorrect it's it's something that is is usually less defined yeah especially because like arbitrary choice in games is something that comes up a lot because a lot of games like they try to avoid that linear feeling by by giving like a lot of choices but it's like do you choose the left path or the right path they ultimately give you the same results so it doesn't it's matter really a choice and, and like if the player doesn't know that then it often actually is okay but mm-hmm. if the player knows it like we're seeing with these paths then we start to point it out and be like hey yeah yeah <laughs> So yeah, I, I think that's a really good question of the day. Boom. Boom that, that, that question. Answer that. <laughs> It'll be in the comment section, don't worry. We will see you next time on the last aquatic human adventure of Submarine. G. Oh, um, bye everybody. <laughs>